Idaho State Police has a truck right outside of the mobile, excuse me, um, right outside of the home and with an investigation team in the front and backyard. We also did see them looking through cars. Now, the latest information that we were told by an Idaho State Police officer is that we were asked not to film the Idaho State Mobile Center because they're going to be removing sensitive property uh, from that area soon. And we were also told that the coroner is going to be here shortly also removing sensitive property from um, the area. So that's the latest update that we do have. Um, the Idaho State Police also said that once they know more information that they will tell us. So we're going to bring an update to you as soon as we learn something from this area. Live in Emmett. Emery Moore, CBS 2 News. Emery, thank you. Let's take another look at these uh, children who are missing. 17-year-old Tristan Sexton, 14-year-old Taylor Summers, 8-year-old Taryn Summers. Now, the two older children, Tristan disappeared in September. Taylor disappeared in October. Now, Taryn just went missing on Monday afternoon. Authorities, they say they don't know if she ran away. They're, they're saying right now that the other two are runaways. But because she's only eight years old, they're concerned for her safety. CBS2, as uh, Emery mentioned, will continue to provide you with more answers as we uncover them. We'll bring them to you live in our newscasts. We'll also have updates on our website, IdahoNews.com, and on the CBS2 mobile app on your smartphone. Don't have the mobile app? Don't worry, you can download it right now. It's free.